So all three shows, the original, SVU, and Organized Crime, finally have the release date for their new season. So the original is going into season 23, SVU is going into 25, and Organized Crime is going into season 4. Now, most of the cast members remain the same. So in the original, we have, well... Jeffrey Donovan had to exit the original show. Let's cover the original first right quick. Jeffrey Donovan was playing Frank Cosgrove, and so he exited the show over creative differences. Uh, Makad Brooks is still going to be Jalen Shaw. Cameron Manheim is Kate Dixon. And then we still have Hugh Dancy, Odelia Halevi, and Sam Waterston playing Nolan Price, Samantha Maroon, and Jack McCoy, respectively. That remains. And then, as I talked about in the last one, we have Reed Scott joining as an as-yet-unnamed detective. And we'll see where that goes. SVU going into 25. We're still going to have Mariska playing Benson. We still... Kelly Giddish is actually... They said that she was going to return. And she's going to return as Amanda Rollins. I think that's a good move there. That's probably going to bring the ratings back up or even more so. Ice-T is still going to be playing, playing Finn. Peter Scanavino is going to be Sonny Carisi. Octavio Pisano as Joe Velasco. And last I checked, I don't... So I think Molly Burnett left the show, and so we won't have Grace Muncie. I think that she was a little bit of an underrated character. I, I felt that she wasn't really given a chance, both as far as like the, the characters in the show and the fans. So I, I felt that there could have been more with her. I, I wish she would have stayed, but that is what it is. And then, of course, we have organized crime. Now, let's get to this according to Screen Rant, another one of my favorite sites that's really good at breaking down stuff when it comes to shows and movies. So... Release date, cast, and everything we know right here for the fourth season of Organized Crime. This show will return for season four, maintaining its serialized format and featuring Chris Maloney as Elliot Stabler. The show finished its third season on a strong note, and NBC has confirmed that Stabler and company will be back for season four. One of many Dick Wolf shows with a home on NBC started as a limited series telling a serial story rather than a normal episode of the week procedural format of the other Law & Order shows. That's another thing that makes this show pretty good. I, so far, I give it about a nine, by the way. The show changed slightly with the second and third seasons, but Law & Order Organized Crime returned to its serialized roots for season four. While there haven't been many specifics revealed about the next season of Organized Crime, there's been enough confirmed that viewers are eagerly anticipating the next installment. It's been confirmed that the fourth season will see the return as Maloney as Stabler, will also likely cross over once again with SVU. Again, usually a good move because each of the... Sh so SVU usually has an average of around 5 million viewers a night. And usually with the crossovers, that kind of brings it together. And they're usually like 7 million. So when they the best crossover they did was between the three shows. And I think that was easily the best move that the Law & Order franchise ever did. Uh, recent news. NBC announced the release dates of multiple delayed... One Chicago and Law and Order shows, including season four of Organized Crime. This will arrive January 18th. Okay, blah, blah, let's skip all that. They're saying some of the same things right here. Ugh, renewed for season four. Okay, I get that. Keep going, keep going. And as far as the cast, uh, we're to expect a lot of the same cast. Uh, Danielle Monet Truitt is going to play Ayanna Bell. We have Ainsley Seeger playing Jet Slumachers. And Rick Gonzalez playing Bobby Reyes. Season 4 story. Season 1 saw Elliot Stable return to the NYPD as part of its elite organized crime task force to stop a crime family while searching for his wife's killer. The second season put him back on the trail of the crime families and the third dealt with sex trafficking. It's be known, it's unknown what the story of organized crime season 4 will be, though tensions with Stable's own family might spill over into his professional life with the introduction of his brothers. Oh, wow. So, that's what we do or expect right now from the upcoming seasons of these shows right here. And I still don't know. I'm willing to predict that season five, if not season 26, probably should be the last season. I don't know about the original show. That could go either way. They might have renewed for one more or two more or three or four more. I mean, this show's been going on forever and ever. So there's no telling when it'll end, but as a hardcore fan, I'm here to watch it until it does end. So January 18th is when they'll be there. Thursday, 8 o'clock is going to be the original, 9 o'clock SVU, 10 o'clock organized crime. 
Of course, I won't be able to watch it till Friday night because I don't have cable, but it's available to watch on Peacock. So I can't wait. I'll be there.